It's a sad day in South Africa. Although Uncle Kathy had not been well for some weeks, but we are never prepared enough to lose one of us, a parent, a leader, a great South African, someone who was a great example in his own life, in the amount of time and energy he has given to serve South Africans, a part of a generation of South Africans without whom we would not be having this democracy. We take the opportunity to sympathize and to send condolences to the family, uh, to Comrade Barbara Hogan, the partner, to the African National Congress, his political home, to the foundation, and to all of South Africa who loved Uncle Kathy because he was one of us. Uh, we will remember him for the way he carried himself. I remember when he was still here in Parliament, one time we went to Robben Island uh, as the Portfolio Committee on Constitutional Development at the time. And he took us around. He acted as our tour guide. And it was one of the most interesting tours I'll ever have because he was able to bring alive his own experiences and the moments he spent in Robben Island as one of the prisoners of that time, together with other uh, members of the generation of uh, Nelson Mandela, Walter Sisulu, and others. So he is among the last of that uh, generation. So it is with sadness that we bid him farewell. But of course, even though their bodies are gone, uh, they remain with us in terms of uh, the memories we will always keep with us, the lessons we will always learn from, and uh, they remain with us in spirit, and therefore we will continue to be sustained by the legacy they've left us.